on what's oh happening right now. My goodness. So even though you need a passport to go to the Philippines, guess what? This weekend you'll be transported there without one. Makikigan nito ang isa na namang kwentong patok sa panlasa. May bago pong pinagkaaguluan ngayon sa Hollywood, dyan po sa Amerika. Pero hindi ito mga celebrities at artista. Alam nyo kung ano? Pinoy street food. <laughs> ah, pagkakaguluan talaga yan. Uh, food, drinks, and dancing. Sa video episode na ito, Kaproud, ay pag-uusapan natin ang mga tusok-tusok, ihaw-ihaw, at kung ano-ano pang Pinoy street food na Bida, hindi na lang sa mga kanto ng eskinita nyo, kundi sa mga kalsada sa global stage na to, Kaproud. It's a month-long food trip in Los Angeles at the Food Bowl. Throughout May, restaurants and chefs are holding special events showcasing the best of the city, many of them Filipino. It's not unusual to see people standing in long lines in the Big Apple. But what's unusual here is that this steady stream of people are waiting to get Adidas, Isao, Permax, Kikyam, Kwek Kwek, Fish Balls, and more. Well, Pinoy street food is becoming a hit in the streets of Los Angeles, and everyone is lining up to grab a bite. In this video, we take you into the kitchen of a beloved local restaurant for some classic breakfast dishes. Feast on Filipino street food from a food truck with a cult following. Bago tayo magpatuloy, siguraduhin nakasubscribe ka na at notification on na din para updated ka sa ating mga video uploads. Fish balls? Oh, I don't like that. My eyes are setting me up for donuts, but my brain is trying to be like, no, no, no. Okay, that's pretty good. That sauce helps a lot. It's like eating a weird sponge. It's like the fish version of a chicken McNugget. <laughs> Enhancement to cover up the taste. I want the real full experience of intestines, so. This lady knows exactly what she's doing. It just tastes like barbecued animal. Usong uso at bidang bida na nga sa mga YouTube videos ang kaliwat ka ng mga Filipino street food challenge at mga Filipino food mukbang. This looks like it has a movie recorded on it. Can you watch it later or what? Well, old movies na yan. Ayunin mo na. Huh? Actually really good. Wow! At sa pagdami at paglaganap ng ating mga kababayang overseas Filipino workers at immigrants sa iba't ibang parte ng mundo. Kasama sa pagpapakilala sa ating masipag at magandang kaugalian dala rin nila ang pagpapakilala sa napakasarap na mga Filipino street food sa iba't ibang parte ng mundo. Do you like pandasal, adobo, or tocino, but with a twist? Shameless buns here in Vancouver got you covered. Vancouver's fungiest food jeepney is serving Vancouverites a little taste of Filipino. We're here to eat Filipino food at Havana, which is a store right behind me. The food here is fantastic and we can't wait to share it with you. Natry mo na ba ang hapunan food truck sa New Zealand na talaga namang nagbibida sa ating Pinoy street food? And to round it off, Taho, a famous Filipino street food. Rainbow of Ensaymada at the Ensaymada Project. The Philam owned Lobster Damas with a seafood Ariscaldo. Filipinos proudly gave LA a taste of Pinoy pride. Maging sa gitnang silangan ay hindi na nagpapahuli ang ating paboritong street food. Bida na din ito sa kaharian ng Saudi Arabia. Maging sa mga kalsada ng Dubai Basta Night Market, hindi mawawala ang ating mga paboritong Filipino street food. Saan ba ang pinaka the best na street food sa Dubai ka proud? Comment muna at pag-usapan natin. Go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> Chili. Chili. It's so good. Okay, so good. Yeah. Only here's the Philippines. Yeah. You need to get a lot of onions on there. Is it onions or shallots? Onions, huh? And what you can do is you can try to scoop up as much onions and chilies and vinegar as you can on top of your, yeah. your squid. <laughs> All right, man. All right. One of each. No joke, that is really good. I'm gonna give you a tip though. It helps being already really hungry. 
There's no way that's going down. Oh my god. Poop gosh. traveled through here. <laughs> oh my god. That's why you don't eat intestines ever. I make tusok tusok the fish bowl, guys. We have actually isa, which is a chicken intestine. And we have also beta max, which is a pork blood. And we also have a pork intestine right here. And we also have a chicken feet. Nakakatuwa na sa paglaganap ng ating mga kababayan sa buong mundo ay hindi nawawala bagkus ay daladala nila ang ating mga kultura at pagkaing tatak Pinoy. Pilipinong Pilipinong timpla niya. Where else can you see that the whole vendor walking around? You know, like he was streaming the whole. Where, where, where can you get like the skewers whenever you want? You can dip it yourself and stuff. Like we wanted to bring that nostalgia back to New York. Gusto ko mga kababayan natin, Pilipino. Dito lahat. Makita kita dito. Dito may nagreunion, nagbe birthday. Everybody. Philippine, Manila, Manila. Adobo fries. So it's our chicken adobo. It's essentially one of the national dishes of the Philippines. Um, we braise our chicken adobo for hours and hours until it's literally falling apart. So I describe it to people as almost like a play on pulled chicken. So we take our fries, and I have to note our fries are dusted with the Sinigang seasoning. Maging dito nga sa Paris, France, ay patuloy ang pagpapalaganap ng ating mga kababayan sa street food. present ang ating mga all-time favorites basta may Filipino Food Festival event dito sa Paris. Ano po yung mga luto nyo? Ah, marami po kaming luto ma. Meron po kaming, uh, of course, ang ating ultimate barbecue, ang ating uh, ang isa, balot. Meron po tayong ano mamaya? Meron po tayong uh, grilled balot. Uh, empanada, sisig, uh, chorizo ng ating ano, ka, ye yellow panda, ano ba to? Lungganisa. Thank you po, Biti Manil, pag, sa pag-invite para makapagtinda dito. Hello. Today po, may chicken po kami, may kwek-kwek, may uh, legume na bulet. <laughs> may hotdog po, may mga legume na... Tita, hindi ko po alam ano, sa Tagalog. Lumpia po na legume, tsaka po ano po, uh, kikyam. Sa, sa, sa pang mga palamig po, ano po yung... Dala nyo ngayon. Sagu po, tsaka po, buko pandan po. <laughs> parang po sa akin masaya po, kasi po parang naalala ko po yung Pinas. And feeling ko po nasa Pinas po ako right now. Because <laughs> food is such a huge part of Filipino culture, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. It tells our story. Mm -hmm. How broad our food, how colorful it is, how tasty. So that's, that's just our Filipino culture. Maraming salamat sa panonood at maraming salamat din sa mga kababayan natin sa anmang sulok ng mundo ay patuloy na isinasabuhay at ibinabahagi ang kultura at pagkaing Pinoy. Kaya ikaw ka proud, ano pang hinihintay mo? I-share mo lang video na to para naman may ambag ka sa pagpapalaganap ng ating napakagandang kulturang Pinoy.